when you go into games like this with a short amount of practice time, uh, at the end of the day, you're just looking for some compete from each player. And uh, certainly we've thrown a lot of information their way here over the last uh, three days. Um, and you're hoping for a level of execution. Uh, but as soon as the work ethic and the compete is there, I mean, I think you, you leave the games being happy about that. At the end of the day, for the guys that will move on to, to main camp next week, it gives them a little bit of a, a leg up, quite frankly, because the systematic play has been already introduced. That will be more of a refresher for the most part next week when DJ gets started. Um, and as well, you're, you're playing against a, a true opposition where you've got uh, a team coming in and you're not playing against teammates, whether it's a scrimmage uh, or you know battle drills uh, within your own team. So uh, certainly to me, that is an advantage uh, that the players can take advantage of. Well, I think it's always great that uh, guys like Sokolov and, and Crookshank and Kastelik and these guys were able to uh, be part of a season last year. Um, that's an advantage for them coming into familiarity with the coaching staff here. And, um, so you can see uh, a little bit of the separation uh, between those guys uh, and maybe the newer draft picks, uh, but certainly there's a you know real a great level of talent here, and um, you know hopefully uh, there'll be some that come to the forefront over here in the next uh, two games, and uh, and then they can take that experience uh, into next Thursday.